What a driving, isn't it, this thing in Telegram? Oh, yeah. Business. Yeah. I don't think if we're going to make a go of this, we're going to have to split the shifts. Yeah. Oh. I don't know like if I'm you doing, want me driving. I'm doing all the heavy lifting here. Sorry. OK, yeah. who are we going to now? Well, this is Sarah, right? Yes. She's been with the company for three years. She's Sarah. been promoted. To shop educator. What does that mean, do you think? I have no idea. She loves country music, so I think we have to sing her a country song. Are you, can you do a good country accent? Honey, I'm from Texas. I can do a great country accent. <laughs> this is going to be massive. Nice. That feels good. Uh, uh, okay. <clears throat> All right. You ready to do this one? Born ready. Let's do it. I don't know why they don't just call this place blowjobs. <laughs> blowies. Blowies. Yeah. But you could open a uh, light drive. If you opened a hair driver and you could call it call Demi it. Lovato's blowies. Yeah. Hello. We're looking for Sarah. Sarah, she's right here. Hi. Hi, Sarah. Hello. How are you? I'm very, very well. Your, uh, your colleagues have said that uh, you've been promoted. Yes. You're okay. now a shop educator. Yeah. And uh, they would love to congratulate you by you. giving you a singing telegram. Ooh. This is a song for you. you. <laughs> Sarah works at Dry Bar. She's been with them for years. And when it comes to blowing people, Sarah has a fear. But Sarah's been promoted at a Brady World store. It looks like Sarah's job won't just be blowing anymore. Now she's a shop educator, a shop educator, with a title and one only hopes a salary that's greater. It doesn't always blow to be a shop educator. I enjoyed that. That was really feels like we're bringing joy to people's day, you know? Yeah. <clears throat> Do you want to play a game? Yeah. Cruise, marry, shag. OK, so one person you've got to marry, one person is just one one night stand, and the other person, rather than killing them, you have to go on a cruise with them, but you don't sleep together. OK? <laughs> Tom Cruise, Hugh Jackman, and Mark Ruffalo. So no, that's three good ones. I've given you three good ones there. Um, I think I'd like to go on a cruise with Tom Cruise because his name is Tom Cruise. You have to. Cruise on cruise. You've got to marry Ruffalo. I would marry Mark Ruffalo in a heart. I hear that Hugh Jackman is a really nice family man. Oh, that's true. I forgot the other one was Jackman. Yeah. Actually, yes. I'm going to marry Jackman and I would let Mark Ruffalo just go to town on me. You let him go all Ruffalo on you? I'd go be Do as you like Ruffalo, it, Ruffalo as you want. Be as Ruffalo <laughs> as you want. That's all I would be. OK, give me three. OK, Rihanna. OK. Beyonce. Oh, goodness me. Nicki Minaj. Well, I'm going to marry Beyonce. I think I would go round the world on a cruise with Nicki Minaj. I just get the feeling she's been with guys who've got more to offer <laughs> than I have. And I don't want to be a disappointment. Do you know what I mean? You know, anacondas and all that. And I'm like more like a fruit rope. <laughs> right, tell me a bit about this place we're going now. Who have we got here? Corey. It's his 25th birthday. He has a very loud laugh, loves mayo. And he puts mayonnaise on everything. All right, this is huge. How does this hat look? Does it make me look stupid? Does it look all right? No, it makes you look like a stud. <laughs> it's so warm in this office. I know. I feel like my whole body is chafing. I feel like I'm showering inside my clothes. Oh, it's hot as bones. It's so... <laughs> I feel like a sweaty sack right now. Hello. Hello. How are you, Corey? <laughs> it's your birthday today, right? Hey, happy birthday! So, Corey, happy birthday. This is a song for, for you. you. Mayo! Mayonnaise is your favorite spread. Hey, Mr. Cory Man, happy, happy birthday. Mayonnaise is your favorite spread. Hey, Mr. Loves Too Much, happy, happy birthday. Mayonnaise is your favorite spread. Everybody, mayo! Mayo! Mayonnaise is your favorite spread. Happy birthday, Cory! Mayonnaise is your favorite spread.
Great spread. Great spread. Great spread. I think it's a hit. We killed it. Dude, we crushed it. How do we go? <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't work after a high five. Not at all. This singing telegram lot is exhausting. I know, like mentally the... I feel like I need a good like little vacation yeah, or something. Yeah, the problem is you don't get any time to yourself. No, not. It's just either. constantly bringing joy to other people, but when do we bring joy to ourselves? You know what I think would be great? Go on. It's if we gave to ourselves. Can I have two boba teas? Two yeah. Thai bobas. Yeah. You should sing for that. You should sing for that. Hey, guys, would you rather Money for the teas, or we'd sing you a song. Money. Boba. You're a Japanese tea. I said boba. You look tasty to me. I said boba. I want you in belly. Yes. <laughs> I don't know about you, but like sometimes it sounds really good when people have auto tune. Yes. And I was thinking like maybe you could have like a natural auto-tune. Okay, well what would that sound like, Demi Lovato? Um, well, it's really easy. All you do is you bite a balloon. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me a bit about this place we're going now. Who have we got here? D he's a dentist, right? Dr. Engel. Dr. Engel. He raised $6,000 for YMCA. Okay. He said if he raised a total of 10000 he would shave his head bald. Wow. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Dr. Engel, how are you? Hello, You're how's it going? <laughs> Dr. Engel, we've heard that you raised... <laughs> Uh, a lot of money for an after-school dropping of the YMCA. So, Dr. Engel, this is for you. You can take your finger out of her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> doctor, doctor, you're a USC man, man, I said, Doctor. You're a Big Clippers fan, I said, thank you. For the money you raised, and then will you get a mohawk? Din, din, din. You raised your skate for the YMCA. You raised your skate for the YMCA. Yay! You said that if you raised $10,000, you'd shave yourself bald. Yes. You raised six. If we made that up to 10, would you let Demi Lovato shave your head? <laughs> I don't believe this has happened. Where are you going to start, Demi? I mean, we might as well just go this way. Hundred percent. Oh God, this is really happening. Do you want to keep the eyebrows, or do you want them to go as well? <laughs> you sure? Yeah. Well, that's a weird choice. Well, that, that was, I don't exactly. think, what anyone was thinking. <laughs> As telegrams go... It's pretty, pretty awesome. I mean, we might be the world's first... Shaving head. ...telegram mobile barbers. Yep. Am I wrong? No. Nope. There's a business here, the Bardo. I'm telling you that right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Demi Lovato, the most fun ever. You can check out... Her new single, Cool for the Summer, is available everywhere right now. It's such a great tune and she is such great fun. Thanks for watching. I hope you found it funny. If you didn't, I'm sure you'll post a really positive response underneath anyway. Click here to subscribe or here to watch more. See you soon.